In this tutorial, we will create a wave curl scene. One of the conditions was for the wave to come out of the turn. I could create it using the noise node. But then the scene was too heavy. Therefore, it is better to apply the method with an animated texture on the plane. Creating a plane and with a large number of segments. You will need to rotate the plane and enable the setting for double-sided display. We use the deformer node. Since we use the directions for deformations, it is important not to rotate the plane using the null object. Then these settings will work. Let's create a light source to see the deformation. We won't need it later. We will need two more deformers with similar settings. Check the direction, it should be on the Z axis. Now let's create a texture. I will use the replica node and not the auxiliary emitter. But you can choose any one. Let's create an animation of the lines. The animation will depend on the lifetime of the particle. Increase the density of the particle so that they look like a line. Now let's apply our texture to the plane.
let's get rid of the sharp loss of lines by creating a fade out for the main particle. creating vast particles. We use the motion node, it has the necessary settings for us. Create simple lines. We need to create a motion blur, but because there are too many particles, we will create an illusion. creating a node for color control. Increase the density, so that there are no line breaks. Let's improve the appearance.
native blur doesn't work well on geometries, creating a fake blur. It takes time to adjust the parameters, I'll show you the final result right away. <laughs> Thanks for watching.